What is going on lads? It's Electric Shock here and today I'm bringing you guys the second episode of Yedanax Road to Glory. If you don't know what this series is about then I'd recommend going to watch the first episode of it. I will leave a link down in the description and I'll also leave the rules down in the description. But if you don't want to watch the first episode I'll quickly give an overview and it is if we win the game then we get to upgrade and of course we're going from non-air bronze to rare bronze to non-rare silver to rare silver to golden, non-rare gold, and then to golden, possibly in forms. And this is the team we've currently got. We've only made two upgrades. Hopefully, I'll be able to get some more in this first game. Wow, that team. Just have a look at that team compared to my team. That is a very solid Premier League team. He's got like RVP and Rooney, Shane Long, Navas. Oh my god, what an error. Oh my god. No, you don't miss. Come on. Oh god, that's RVP. Oh, good save again. CSAC is an animal. Really like him. Oh my god, he's onside. No! How does he miss? How many times can Gordon miss? Let's have a look at the replay. How did he stop that? David De Gea. Safe. Get a knack. Get a knack. Get a knack. Get a knack. Get a knack has missed. <laughs> I can't score. I literally can't score with this team. Even our best player. I've somehow managed to put that one in the side netting. There we go, that's half time. Now I've been in control of this game, you know, we've had the chances, we've had the possession. Just need to start taking some of them. Enrique is on the run. Don't give away the corner there, this is a very promising situation for the opponents. Clear that. Oh, CSAC, you put it in your own net. Good effort though, mate. I don't think this guy deserves to be winning. Uh, he should have done a lot more with that. Come on, CSAC. We need to upgrade this goalkeeper so badly. Oh, no. He's onside as well. That's a goal. He's missed. Wow, we're still in this game. Come on. Need to push for this goal. Oh, finish that one. Finish that one. So it's one all. I didn't commentate over that one. I was really just concentrating. Have a look at this luck. He goes for the Meg, falls back to him, and Akpom does get his first goal. Go one more. Go on, mate. Go on. Go on. Finish that. No, that's the weakest shot I've ever seen, Gordon. Just put your foot through it, mate. Decent ball. Oh my god. Oh my god. Have we missed? How are we not winning this game? It is beyond me. That's full time. The third draw. Um, this is actually a really even game. About the same amount of shots, same shots on the just about. We had a little bit more possession, but I think we should have won that game. Alright, here we go. This is the second game of the episode. Need to pick up an upgrade here, but just have a look at these teams we're playing. You know, that's a very solid 3 5 2 team. He's got a lot of pace in here, like Sherla and Lucas and Callahan and Higuain. He's got some solid. Defensive midfielders and that, you know, that centre back um, pairing of Mangala and Cahill is one of the toughest to break down. Oh, yes, Matt Hummels in real life. That was a classy block. Find that ball. Go, Akapon, for your second. I should have cut that one back. Why did I take the shot? I'm sorry if you can hear these fireworks going off. Don't know why they're going off at like 7 o'clock at night, but, you know, that's. Australia for you. Ah. Wow, that's good play. CSAC's going to be doing more with that. I just can't touch the ball this game. He's been absolutely all over me. And it's another time where we're going to go behind. Just very nice passing, to be honest. Oh, that's a great challenge. Can he finish this one? Has to. Wow, that was one of the weirdest finishes I've ever seen. The fireworks are still going off. Just after I score. Alright, that's half time. And we've been in this game. He's keeping possession. It's very even apart from that. This guy does like to play it around a lot. He's trying to build some goals up. Not the best tactic to do in FIFA 15. Oh, that's a goal. Mertens has just played uh, he's just played one through ball. And we're back down again. We have to build all that way again. The cut back. Someone's there. No. Oh, that's a penalty. Is it a penalty? Yes, it is. Come on, we need to score this for melee, for upgrades. And what is Czech doing? He's just slide tackled Duncan Watmore in the box. Very clumsy by the 
experience at Chelsea goalkeeper. All right, come on, Yedinak. There we go. Finally, Yedinak scores. Well, he did score last episode, but for the amount of chances he's had, he finally takes one, and that is two upgrades. Come on, boys. That's a pen again. Oh, my God. He's given away two silly penalties. No need to do that. And Dabba Louise should be off, mate. That is filthy. He should swap shirts with Ronaldo Aarons at the end of the game. Come on. It's only 20 minutes to go. We've scored, yes. That is four upgrades and hopefully five upgrades if we can hold out this game. Ooh, he had a knack. Great penalty, mate. This guy did know I was going down the middle, but, you know, if you put it above the keeper's head, they're not really going to save it. Well, here we go. He's just bringing out his keeper. What is he doing? The fireworks are going off. And it is 4-2. The first win of this series. And Akpom is the goal scorer there. I think that's his second goal. And look how much it means to these players. Might be their last game. All right. So that superb comeback. And those two goals very late to Mille Yelenak did give us six upgrades. And that's because we did get two upgrades for the win. Two upgrades for one Yelenak goal. And also the other Yelenak goal got two upgrades. So that's six upgrades all together and that means we're almost up to a full non-rare bronze team all right so these are the positions that we are upgrading the first position that we are upgrading is the goalkeeper Cizak wasn't that too bad of a goalkeeper but you know we're gonna have to move on and Vickers does look like an average goalkeeper he's probably the cheapest though that's why I bought him out on a right back I did pick up Hector Bellerin plays for Arsenal actually looks like a very good card he's got Quite a bit of pace, and I think he's got three-star skills. He's very young as well, so I think we'll be seeing that guy in the future. Out on the right mid position, I did get rid of Duncan Watmore for this bloke. Name, is it Ryan? No, Lloyd Isgrove. Looks alright. The main stat I saw there was that pace. Um, at cam position, we unfortunately have to get rid of, get rid of Howison. He was one of the best players in the team, but you know we're going to have to upgrade him to Ryan Mason. Looks like a very good player. He's got very well-rounded stats, so hopefully he'll be able to be the playmaker of the team. Up front, I did decide to keep Gordon because I think he scored the majority of the goals for us. So I got rid of Big Akpom for our main man from the Adelaide United career mode. It is James Wilson. He cost me three and a half grand, but, you know, what a beast he is in career mode. He's scoring me goals for fun. Hopefully in this series, he's going to score me some goals for fun. And the other position, the final position that we are upgrading is the left back position. Lafferty was a solid card. You're going to have to come out for this. A pace abuser named Boca, Boca Yago. Boca Yogo. I'm not sure. He's got 86 pace though. So this is the team. We only need two more upgrades and we are at a, a full non rare, no, a full rare bronze team and we can start upgrading to a silver team. So I hope you guys did enjoy this. It might have a little bit too much upgrades, but I just want to, you know, I want to do this series quickly because if I do this series quickly I can do it with other players if you know you enjoy it but I don't want it to be too slow and I don't think we'll be scoring two goals with Yedinak in a hurry but anyway I hope you did enjoy this episode I'll speak to you guys soon have a lovely day and goodbye